Hey guys, just some real quick before we start, just wanted to remind you that on June 24th of this month that I will be at Too Many Games, and no, I'm not a vendor or having a booth or anything like that, I'll just be walking around, and if you're a fan of the channel, come by, say hi, would love to hang out with you and meet some fans, so. Yep, that is June 24th, 2023 in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, so. You live in PA? Come on down, and I'd love to see you there. Alright? Alright, enjoy the rest of your regularly scheduled content. What's up? What's happening? What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Animation Station. Your number one stop decision for anything and everything animation, including a sponge at Liz and a pineapple under the sea. And welcome back! To the Aquatic Neptune Spongebob Reactions. Let me turn the volume down. Oh, it's actually too low. My dumb butt. Hold on a second. There, that should be a good spot. Welcome to another Aquatic Neptune Reaction. Welcome to the Cursed Popsicles. You guys know how it works by now, so I'll just give a quick tally for the dumb moment counters, and we'll jump right in, shall we? Okay, so Spongebob has 153. Patrick has 330. Squidward has 24. Mr. Krabs has 21, Sandy has 5, and Plankton still has 7. So let's see how many dumb moment counters we add this time, shall we? 3, 2, 1, play. Turn it up one more. Sorry, sorry. I think it was right there. It's about halfway, I think. Yeah. I'm not gonna give a dumb moment for the super stuffed Oreo because that's that's just a cool visual. And I'm not gonna lie, I probably would have done something like that too if I had Oreos. So, not gonna give him a dumb moment for that. It's just funny. Good morning, Patrick. Uh, whoa, whoa, what are you doing? I bought these mega stuffed Oreos, family sized, and it only came with one Oreo. And it's not even family sized. This is just a midday snack for me. It does come with a lot. You just took them all apart and made one giant Oreo. No, I didn't. You want me to prove it to you or what? Ugh. Ugh, friction. You see, SpongeBob? Ah. Not even a minute in. Good grief, Patrick. Uh, uh, they, they only gave me one. A watermelon? Just one Oreo. I got scammed. Wow, actually you're right. They did only give you one Oreo, and it's flat like a pancake. You should sue the Oreo company. Oh, don't worry. Ugh. I'm planning to. Do you by chance want an Oreo filling pizza? Why are you guys eating that slop when you could be eating a SpongeBob popsicle? Oh no, this creepy thing's back again. Oh no, okay. I better fix my hat for this. Oh boy. Oh boy, this is not gonna end well. <laughs> they're still horrifying. Don't worry, they updated the ingredients. And now, there's a last chance of them being deformed. 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 Dave is the yellow part. Another dumb moment for Patrick. Good grief. Pineapple? Even more pineapple than this pineapple gum I got at the convenience store. Hey, that's offensive. I live in a pineapple. Yeah, where your mom lives in a coconut. <laughs> Not the moment. That's just really funny. Don't say it. That guy got hit the head with a coconut. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's fitting because SpongeBob said it in the Among Us video, and now Patrick actually gets to say it in this video. Actually, believe it or not, she lives in a normal house. Not all my family's weird, Squidward. I don't know why we have to wait for the SpongeBob popsicles to come back. I got one right here. <laughs> Patrick. 
Patrick. Why? Was it with Patrick and making his friends not alive anymore? Like, what the hell? Goodness gracious, bro. Squidward, would you like my SpongeBob popsicle? Okay, now that's the creepiest SpongeBob popsicle that I've ever seen. SpongeBob popsicles? Arr, that's just a fad that will die off soon. I'm gonna stick to the basics. Where? What was that? Huh? Why is that Krabby Patty white? Oh well, the customers won't even notice. Is that an Oreo filling patty? Is Krabs really that stupid that he actually cooked it with the Krabby Patties? Bruh. <laughs> Dumb moment counter for you. I thought you were smarter than that. Yeah, it's delicious. Try it. It's so good, it'll make you jump in the air and then fall back down to your death. Hmm, that's questionable. SpongeBob, how does you get in the fire? <laughs> is he really falling for this again? This is the same thing that happened the last time. He really thought that SpongeBob died in the last Popsicle episode. Then he saw the rapper sitting right next to it and he finally put two and two together. So how does he not know this by now? Freaking nink and poop. At this point, put yourself in the fryer, and here's five stupid moma counters for you, crabs. Good grief, bro. Uh, no one sees it. Good thing I made these new flyers. What's wrong, Patrick? You barely touch your Oreo patty. Yeah, SpongeBob, I'm just not feeling it, but I got a new idea. Ugh. Cookie dough pizza. Oh, 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 cookie brain damage. What? You know what? A cookie dough pizza doesn't sound that bad. But make sure it's homemade. Don't get, like, those crappy excuses of dessert pizza they used to sell at the pizza shops and restaurants. That stuff is nasty. But if you do it homemade, probably not being pretty good. Never know, it depends on your cooking skills. No dumb moment for that, because that's actually a decent idea. Oh, oh. How long is that going to take to bake, Patrick? I mean, you're going to make the biggest cookie in the world. I don't know, SpongeBob. Oh, oh, oh. But it's going to be delicious. Oh, oh, oh. SpongeBob Pop School looks stupid. Like a hillbilly. And now he's calling back to the Monopoly line. Where Squidward called Gary a hillbilly. Uh, Patrick, uh, look at mine! Ah! Ah! What the? Ah! F Creepy counter. Creepy counter. Thank you. Moving on. Bleeding tears. Mm, that's that's as freaky as hell. <laughs> Appropriate reaction. Thank you, Patrick. Smash it with a watermelon. Uh, I left the blood trail. <laughs> Was not expecting that. Another one for the creepy counter. His smashed remains dripping down the water. Ugh, that is freaky. I'm getting all these watermelons. I'm not giving up the secret. You <laughs> <laughs> squashed my SpongeBob pop. What is it with Patrick and coconuts? Give me yours. No, I had to do what I had to do. Yours was possessed. All right, that's it. I'm taking it for myself. This is your fault. What do you have to say for yourself? Watermelon? That's a good question. 
No! Screw your ad about your garbage movie that's going to absolutely suck. Get out of here. Now a watermelon in the pool? Are you really that bored, bro? It's, it's floating! If watermelon float, then how do we have them under the sea? Wow. Shots fired to battle from Bikini Bottom. I'm gonna land on it! Uh. Miss. <laughs> Geronimo! <laughs> Your turn to be hit with a watermelon. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Huh. Wow, would you look at that? <laughs> I'm more surprised Patrick floats than the watermelon does. Wow, Patrick, look, another watermelon. I've never seen a watermelon with the seeds on. Patrick did, didn't he? He already murdered SpongeBob in this episode. I want to put it past him. Top. Darn it, I only like seedless. What are you guys doing with my spare brain? That's your spare brain? Oh, no one died. Um. Sorry. Carry on. Your head do be looking like a watermelon, don't it? <laughs> hey, at least I have two brains. You don't even have one. That Ouch. You want some ice with that burn? What do you get for having pineapple bubblegum? And Patrick, if you were a fruit, this is the fruit you'd be. Star fruit. So irrelevant. Who even eats star fruit? My boy Spongebob triggered. You want some fries with that salt, bruh? Dude is so triggered. SpongeBob, Patrick's not shaped like that. How dare you? He's shaped like a circle. A really fat one. Hey, you can't roast me like that. Get him! Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Another coconut. How many times are we gonna do this joke? Oh, that guy got hit in the head with a coconut. Shut up, Patrick! You already said this line. <laughs> Say it one more time, you're getting five dumb moment counters. I swear, bro. Again. How do you break these stupid things anyway? Ah. Like that. That was easy. Ugh. Look, look at the color, it's rotten inside. Ah, well, I think I know how to fix this. All it needs is a little... Sprinkles! Spongebob, you fool. If you don't want coconuts falling on you, you should have been like me and wore a coconut helmet. My noggin is protected. I think the watermelon says otherwise, Patrick. And that's another repeat of the coconut joke. Okay, five stupid moment counters for you. Freaking Nimrod. Watermelon helmets now, does it? I'm jealous. Squidward has a permanent watermelon helmet. Let's test it out. Wait, wait, no. I don't actually have a watermelon helmet. I'm Squidward, I'm Squidward. I'm Squidward, 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 Squidward. Yeah, opposite day. I'm Squidward, I'm Squidward, 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 I'm Squidward, I'm Squidward, I'm Squidward, Squidward, Squidward. Wait, it's not enough to look like Squidward. You have to act like him, too. Oh boy, do I love the clarinet. I practice and practice all day but never get any better. Now you try. Okay. I'm squidward, I'm squidward, 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 squidward. <laughs> Wait, but if you're a squidward, that means you gotta act like him. Oh yeah. Hey, hey, no, 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 no steal on my line, squidward. That, that. Damn it. No steal on my lines, SpongeBob. What did I tell you about stealing my lines? Another popsicle. What's gonna happen? Oh, we're gonna watch it melt. Okay. Uh. 
I'm going to skip ahead. Where'd my SpongeBob popsicle go? Dummy, you left it out in the sun. It's going to melt. Another dumb moment counter for you. Goodness gracious, Patrick. Use whatever semblance of a brain you still have in your cranium. Ugh, what is that? Ugh. Oh no, but someone took my SpongeBob popsicle. Uh, oh! oh. Well, whoever has your SpongeBob popsicle must have had an infection, huh? Okay. I already warned you 14 plus from here on out. I'm not censoring the blood again. That was a pain in the neck to do with some of the other ones. Well, I know it's not actual blood, but you know what I mean. I'm not censoring it. Just creepy counter. Creepy counter. It's just a mushy. Wait, maybe this is your SpongeBob popsicle. Huh. How on earth do you guys eat these things? I just let it melt a little bit. <laughs> That is horrifying. It looked like he got literally shanked. Like, that's the entry wound, and then this is all the splatter. Like, goodness gracious, bra. I literally just reviewed a whole 20 minute episode of SpongeBob where there was dark humor. I was not expecting hypothetical blood. Goodness gracious. Creepy counter's already up if you can't already see it. Just... Ugh. Look at it! What in the... Wilson! Don't worry, Squidward. I know CPR. I know how I can fix... Wrinkles! That's how you do CPR in Sweden. Actually, that did fix it. Huh. Why don't they just sell them with sprinkles? Oh, that that's why! That's why! These popsicles are possessed. I gotta get the other side too. I gotta fix this thing. Make it edible again. Ow. Spongebob, Fail. I didn't know you had hair. What? I, I never did. Or do I? Why does that one have hair? It's looking like Frankenstein. I'm tired of opening SpongeBob popsicles and for them to be all creepy. Huh. Hopefully this one's gonna be normal. Nope, the black uh, tears. Uh, 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 okay, that's it. I can't take this anymore. I'm getting creeped out. I'm going home. Safe travels, guys. It was nice seeing you. Finally, I can go home now. Uh, Give me my brain back. I can't believe Nickelodeon would approve such a cursed popsicle about me. Ruining my brand. Oh, well, it's off my mind now. Uh, let's relax. Let's wind down. What the? Why is it so dark all of a sudden? What's going on? Ah! Very funny, Squidward. Putting Kool-Aid in my bathtub. Shh. Ah, Squidward and his crazy pranks. So tired of it. Good night, Gary. Gary, stop licking me. I already fed you. Gary, go to bed. Okay, that's it. You bet. Ah! What the f And that's why I gotta stay at your place for the night, Squidward. <laughs> uh, phobia of ice cream? That's the saddest thing I've ever heard. Nah, I don't have a phobia of ice cream. Just those Spongebob popsicles. See? I brought my own ice cream. I thought I could bribe you with it. Netflix and chill. SpongeBob, I don't even have Netflix. Well, fine, I guess you could stay. I have a doghouse outside you could stay in. No, oh, heck no, I'm not staying. I'm getting out of here. I'm not staying at a house that doesn't have Netflix. Who has a Hulu account and doesn't have Netflix? Thanks for letting me stay at your place, Patrick. Smart people, I don't want to waste money on these stupid, on these stupid subscription service piles of crap. Especially the premium crap. Netflix is enough. You don't need anything else. Means a lot. It's the least I could do after all those coconuts that fell on your head, SpongeBob. Oh, 
Oh boy, I hear the ice cream truck. Patrick, no, no, no! What? It's fine. I just got a splash from a popsicle. And it murdered him. Okay. Um. Is that it? Another WTF episode. Uh, okay. Didn't really give out as much counters as usual, though. That's a bit odd. Aside from the creepy counter, because this was a very creepy episode. Uh, what's the next one? Let me check my schedule. Uh. Ah. Murray Man and Barnacle Boy. Okay. See you for that one, as well as the reviews of Enemy in Law and Murray Man and Barnacle Boy 6. Peace!